In the previous video, I got big uh, Proskit MT1210, which is the older one. If you remember, last time I got the overview, do check it out for this uh, Proskit MT1210. And uh, for this video, particularly, I will be overview and opening a new box, which is Proskit MT1220. Its price is around 55 ringgit, so it can come around, which is around 12 dollar, which I search here. Yeah, twelve dollars something, and yeah. So let's open up this bad boy and we we'll review it. Kato with on pack, which is kind of nice. Okay, let's do it. Okay, we you know this is the Proskit MT one two zero three half digital multimeter compact but malfunction. Right, so we got some. Spec here is LED light, we got NCV, display, buzzer, backlight, input socket, range switch, data hole, NCV indicator, and transistor socket as well. So what we can make difference between this MT1210 and MT1220, which is we now overview this. Okay, let's open it up. Let's see now. Okay, comes with the leads and then okay, brand new multimeter from the come for the fuse as well for the MT221220, which is quite nice for here. What you can see from here, okay, some safety consideration. Okay, this is CAT2600 volt. Okay, what it have? Okay, this is low battery indication. Voltage unit, current unit, resistance unit. Okay, so you can see this Pro Skit MT110 comparison here, and as compared to these two here, much difference. We got the holder is much nicer here, as compared for the older one MT1210 is simple holder, as compared to this which is quite nice structure holder, and we got. Okay, this one you have to power it button here, power up the, and this one we just got just like rotary, which is one of my favorite. You just have to rotary this, which is easier than compared to you have to press button from here. So here we got backlight, and this one the placement of black mat is here as compared to this. This is much nicer because you can just on the black light here as compared to this. You have to keep. Uh, this is the last video I already explained, which is quite a problem. I think with this, you have to press in. I'm not sure it's either this multimeter problem or the product is like this. So, anyway, off this. Okay, we got a hole, which is quite nice. The feeling of the rotary is very nice here, as compared to this one. It's very. Yeah, it's a bit, a bit like soundy here and uh, the placement of the emitter base current which for the transistor also nice which is the middle you can just place it here as compared to this is a bit uh, maybe it's a, on the right side making middle also nice uh, good done from the MT1220 uh, much more improvement I guess from the before one pro skit one is pro skit leads uh, we come with green color here which is quite nice, colorful, and calm here. We can put it in the middle. Okay, we'll take out this. Okay, which is put. Let's think the continuity here. Okay, kind of nice building sound. All right. Okay, and you can see from the back for the MT1220, we're using the AAA battery as compared to the MT1210, which is using 9 volt battery here compartment. And this is this using 3 AAA battery. So, in this terms, actually, I'm not so fan of the AAA battery here. I kind of like this one, it's much simpler. Just plug in one 
don't have to like change three like this so in this favor i'm kind of like for the mt10 1210 for the battery parts here uh, this one is for bin for this one as compared for this i not much like for this one and for the back here you got holder which is nice this this part of mt1220 is quite a nice for me we got a holder for this part as compared for this don't have and uh, that's kind of it for the overview for mt1220 guys don't forget to like share and subscribe see what else you can share what's the specialty for this multimeter Okay, that's kind of it. Thank you for watching. See ya. Bye.